how to create GCB bank account online. So what are the things that you need before you'll be able to create this account? You need one passport size photograph, you need a proof of residence and postal address. You can use any of the following, the utility bill, the tenancy agreement, the employer's referral letter, a valid photo identity, passport or the driver's license or the voter's ID. And then you will make an initial deposit of 80 Ghana cities. So all I have to do is just go to Google and then type in GCB GCB. So when it comes, just go to the GCB bank official website, okay? And then the top hand side, you have personal. So when you go to the personal under it, you have savings account, okay? And then we have the current account, okay? So under the savings account, we have a standard savings account. So we are trying to open a standard savings account. So when we click on it, it will bring you to the requirement, the one that we have just said. Okay, so we are not just going to waste our time here. And then at the right hand side, you will see that we have opened a current account. Okay, then you click on apply now. When you click on it, it will take you to these forms. The forms is in two folds. Okay, so the first one is for entities, business. Okay, so if you want to open a business account, you have to use the first one. And then these are some of the business that you can open accounts with. All these are the types of the business you, you can open an account with. And then we have the individual form too. And then these are the types of individual account that you can also open. Okay, so let's open an individual account. So when you click on the individual account, it says that you can open an account for all these types. But when you look at the right hand side, you can see that we have view the PDF. Okay, so just click on it and then you will see the forms. This is the GCP account opening forms that you will fill. We have two ways that you can fill these forms. Okay, the first one is either you will print it out. After downloading it, you will print it out and then fill it with an ink. Okay, and then when you are done, you will scan it back and follow the steps that I'm going to show you. Or you are going to download this on your computer and then you are going to edit it from the laptop of the computer so i'm going to teach you how to do it how to edit it with the computer how to download it onto your computer and then edit it and then after that we sent it to where we are supposed to send it and get our account created okay so what you have to do is that after downloading it just go to go and then type in adobe pdf converter to word okay so when it comes just select adobe this one okay and then over here you can simply select the downloaded forms okay so just select the downloaded forms and then it is going to convert it into word for you so as you can see here it is free you are not going to pay anything okay it is totally free so as you can see our forms is ready all that you have to do is just sign in with your email address and you can download it it has converted the pdf into a microsoft word for us so let's download it so it has finished downloading and let's open it so this is our word forms okay now we can edit it we can fill the forms online make sure to enable editing mode okay so now we can edit it put in our name and everything without even printing it out okay so this is how to go by it I am just showing you how to do it without you printing out the forms and save you money. So all I are going to do is to just fill it on your computer, okay? Show the name, the first name, the other name, everything. Just fill it. It is easy, okay? You can do it. Or as I said, you can print it out and then use your pen, your ink, to fill it and then scan it back into a PDF form. Okay, so when you are able to just fill this using your laptop, the next thing that you have to do is to simply save it back into a PDF form. Okay, what I have to do is just save it on your computer into a PDF format. Okay, make sure to select PDF format. Okay, then you save it 
on your computer as you can see we have saved it on our computer the next thing that you have to do is to open WhatsApp with your phone or your computer. Then save the GCB line, this one, on your WhatsApp contact, okay? And then chat them. They are going to respond to you. Tell them that you want to open an account with them. And then they are going to ask you to send the PDF. The PDF that we just filled, they are going to ask you to send it. They are going to make an initial deposit of 80 Ghana CDs. As at now that I'm making this video, you are going to make an initial deposit of 80 Ghana CDs. And they are going to open this account for you without you visiting any branch okay and then you are going to add all the necessary documents that i told you from the beginning if you don't trust it and then you want to also make it as fast or as quick as you could the next thing i have to do is to just take the forms walk to any branch of gcb closer to you and then give them the printed one that you filled with your ink and then make the initial deposit there as well and you are going to open it for you without any difficulty thank you for watching this video and then see you in my next video